Hi friends, Miss Attacto here. Today we're going to be reading Dreamers by Juji Morales. This is the true story of how Juji came over from Mexico with her baby son because she wanted a better life for them. Where Juji was from in Mexico, the Y is pronounced like a J. So that's why her name is spelled a little bit differently than we say it. I dreamed of you. Then you appeared. Together we became amour, love amour, resplendent life, you and I. One day we bundled gifts in our backpack and crossed the bridge outstretched like the universe. Adios corazon. And when we made it to the other side, thirsty, in awe, unable to go back, we became immigrants. An immigrant is somebody who moves from one country to another. Migrantes, you and I. The sky and the land welcomed us in words unlike those of our ancestors. There were so many things we didn't know, unable to understand, afraid to speak. We made a lot of mistakes. You and I became caminantes. That means they were doing a lot of walking. Thousands and thousands of steps we took around this land until the day we found a place we had never seen before. Suspicious, improbable, unbelievable, surprising, unimaginable. Where we didn't need to speak, we only needed to trust, and we did. Books became our language. Books became our home. Books became our lives. We learned to read, to speak, to write, and to make our voices heard. Someday, we will become something we haven't even yet imagined. But right now, we are stories. We are two languages. We are lucha. We are resilience. We are hope. We are dreamers. Sonadores of the world, we are love, amor, love. Like I said at the beginning, this is the true story of how Juji and her son came from Mexico. They lived in Texas for a little while, and they came here because Juji wanted her son Kelly to meet um, his grandfather before he died. She also came here so that she could marry um, so she could marry Kelly's dad. When she first came. Juji talked about how she felt really scared. She didn't know the language. She didn't know the customs. And things were a lot different here than they were in Mexico. But once she found the library, she felt a lot better. It talks about how where she was from, they didn't have libraries the same exact way that they, did in, that they do in Texas. So for her to be able to go and check out a book anytime she wanted for free was amazing. She says that the books really inspired her and it helped her learn the language. And that is why she chose to grow up and become an author. I hope you enjoy.